jiseme wacha mambo ya wengine Raisi aliyetuacha alie anaitwa Kibaki alikuwa anatuuliza wakati wakati ule walipokuja pamoja wakatengeneza the grad coalition government na former prime minister na sisi tulikuwa PNU yeye alikuwa kiongozi wa uh, ODM tukipeleka maneno ya chuki kwake alikuwa anatuambia kama we unafikiria we ni mzuri sana dunia hii kuliko watu wale wengine wote kwenda sumama kwa wao uchaguliwe alafu kuja tufanye kazi na wao lakini kama huwezi kwenda huko uchaguliwe kubali wale walichaguliwa kule pia ni viongozi ukae na wao na uongee mambo ya maana ambayo itasaidia Kenya mimi simjui eh, former prime minister sana lakini namjua kwa sababu tumekuwa naye kwa serikali hizo tatu ya kibaki ya, ya uhuru na hii mambo ya kusema ya kwamba at hardship unajua mambo mengine sitaki niseme hapa lakini kusema ukweli wewe kusimama kusema at hardship ya Raila na uhuru ndio ilifanya uhuru asiende kanisani umewafanya wa Kenya kodoo aina gani how can you hata sina maneno ya kusema hiyo cuz it's so irritating Mtu mzima uhuru ni mzee mzima anajielewa huwezi kufanya yeye ni mtoto ya kwamba akisalimia mtu tena unataka kutuambia baba hadi kanisa hapa si ni kanisa Kwa hivyo nilikuwa nataka kusema kwamba simjui sana nyinyi mnamjua zaidi lakini tangu tuanzie mambo ya 2022 nimekumkaribia na yale ambao tumehubiliwa hapo maneno matatu Tumewabiwa hope faith and Wacha niwaambie huyu mzee ako na upedo kwa roho yake sana kwa Kenya hii. Yale maneno amepitia kwa mikono ya wengi kama hangekuwa na mapenzi ya Kenya hii hatungekuwa tumekaa hapa leo. Ako na uwezo wa kusema Kenya ichomeke na ichomeke. Na amesema tuketi pamoja. Ako na imani Juzi kuliko kuwa na hii migogoro mingi kumekuwa judges kutoka Afrika wamekuja Kenya. Wamekaa na yeye akaniita tukakaa pale. Walipokuwa wanazungumza na yeye he was just talking about his faith in the democracy of this country and Africa at haku akuogea mambo ya kura ambayo yake iliibiwa ama lingine. Na nikaona kiongozi wa ajabu kwa roho. Wakati huo mgumu bado wako na faith na na imani na faith sasa ile imebaki ni hope na tutabeba hizo tatu mimi nimesikia mahubiri tutabeba hizo tatu sitakuwa zetu tunapoenda hapa bele na tunajua Mwenyezi Mungu atatutajaria that will become our philosophy from here from the mark community going into the future and we will overcome in the name of our lord jesus christ kwa hivyo Sitaki niseme zaidi ya hayo tumekuja kuomba pamoja e, tuombe Kenya tuipende Kenya peda jirani yako huyu jamaa anaitwa majina yake mzito Jaduongo Mera e, huyu nimekuwa nikiwaambia the rules are now we have also i think three four rules ambao wamekuwa MCAs Mount Kenya this is becoming the global community in this country wako kila pari na wanachaguliwa kila kona na tutaendelea na dunia hiyo mmemchagua endeleeni to embrace everybody na mimi nataka kufikisha hapo ili niweze kum... we have the nominated senator wa hapa nimemuona na ninasikia nikishidwa eh? elected is nominated nasikia na nasikia nikishidwa kusema ya kwamba hata kama si usimame basi ni, si, si, unajua ni, ni aibu pia kiongozi ayuruk eh, manares if I, you are here and i'm not saying that you are here because ideally you should be the one receiving us but i, I respect your desire for quietness today but uh, nataka kumuita uh, madam before that i say that this what tusije tukawekwa ugumu na, na na siasa mpaka tushidwe kwenda pahali tungetaka kwenda na kwa hayo machache i want now to invite the wonderful lady ambaye amepigania Kenya hii na wametebea safari ya Kenya hii na usidaganywe na mtu yote hapa 
hamna ni wachache sana ambao wamebaki Kenya hii ambao wamepigania haki ya mnyonge haki ya mnyonge vile baba amepigania haki ya mnyonge Kenya hii na mwingine ambaye amefanya vile vile bila kujikujali mambo ya kwenda kuumauma alithiama vitu vingine hapa na pale ni mheshimiwa Mada wa gari Karua nataka mkadipiche anapokuja kuzungumza nasi ili pia aweze kutuidia baba hapa baadaye thank you so much May sisi Yesu Praise God Nataka ku acknowledge mabishop wetu wote 